Hello guys and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. In the last episode, if you don't remember, we went ahead and we listened to Mr. Edogawa go on and on and on forever. Uh, I like to record these in bulk, so I'm, not I'm still not entirely sure how long that went on, but it felt like it lasted an eternity. Anyways, in this episode, we're going to talk to Chihiro real quick. Yuki-san, um, about what happened the other day, I am sort of overreacted I and I um, just wanted to say I'm sorry. I get really nervous when I talk to people, although I know I should really do something about it. It's it's especially bad when I talk to boys. All I can think about is running away in that situation. You want to go ahead and choose. I'm a guy. I, I know, that's why I'm so nervous now. Uh, sorry, I know I can't perform my duties on the student council if I'm like this. I have to try harder to overcome this phobia. Okay, so an easy way to check uh, who your social, what social links are open is by going to the town map. And then pressing square where you see these cards. So, Bunkichi and Mitsuko, uh, Tomochika and Miyamoto, and Chihiro is not accessible yet, so that's why her thing is grayed out and it doesn't say up. Up also means that you will be able to raise your social link if you go ahead and uh, hang out with them. So just like before, we're gonna go ahead and hang out with Tomochika. I'm so bored. You got any plans after this? If you're free, let's hang. I'll be at my seat as usual. Let's see, what do you have to say? Oh, Yuki, I was just thinking, I bet Takabe-san has some pretty high standards, huh? You probably have to be a real Prince Charming if you want to get her attention. Well, it's not like it matters to me anyway. I'm not really interested in her. By the way, you heading out? I got nothing to do again. Ooh, lucky me. Let's go somewhere then. And it's got to be you know where. Despite its simple appearance, the soup has a complex flavor that's, in that's enhanced by the noodles. Man, I'm so sick of this, dude. The best answer here is, what, of life? Life? Dude, you watch too much reality TV. But I guess, yeah, you could say I'm sick of life. I mean, I get up, go to school, sit through lame-ass lectures, eat, watch TV, and go to bed. Okay, that settles it. I'm gonna get myself a girlfriend. Right now! The best option here is to say, good luck. What a cool thing to say! Soon, I'll have a girlfriend and be just as cool as you. Alright, I think I'm gonna pull the trigger on my secret plan. I told you about the teacher, right? I'm gonna ask her out and get her to fall in love with me. Her name is Miss Kano. You heard of her? She teaches third year ethics. We get along pretty well. She's not mainstream beautiful, but she's really pretty. She's got these cute little eyes, a sexy body. Uh, don't tell anyone about this, okay? You're the only one who knows. Tomochika told me more about his plan. I feel like our relationship is stronger. Dude, I'm getting so psyched! Let's cook up a plan of attack. Tomochika and I chatted on the walk home. So wait, I'm pretty sure during the first episode he said that he was hoping that he'd get oh, Miss Kano yeah. as his yeah. teacher. But she's a third year teacher and you're a second year. So of course you wouldn't get her as your teacher, you dweeb. Welcome back. Hey there. I'm sure you're tired of hearing this, but make sure you're fully prepared before going to Tartarus. You never know what'll happen there. There are some aspects to battle that we simply can't manage with an unprepared leader. I'm sure you don't want to put everyone else in danger, so keep that in mind. Hmm? Is something the matter? The higher we advance up Tartarus, the stronger our enemies will become. Do you feel that your current equipment is adequate? Yeah, I think so. I see. That's good to hear, just don't get careless. You should consider paying Officer Kurosawa a visit when you have the time. By the way, I can't believe it's already the last day of April. It was probably one of the hardest months of my life, honestly. I hope we, I can relax a little next month. Uh, I wouldn't count on it. By the, way. By the way, when we were fighting in Tartarus, I was thinking, every Shadows have stuff they're not good at, like, they have weaknesses too. Like how I'm not good at studying, you know? For a sec, I thought they were kind of relatable. Hmm. <laughs> Also, one thing that I want to bring up is that 
The Ace Attorney anime has this uh, infamous scene with the character Red White. Uh, you don't even need, you don't need to know who. If you haven't played the Ace Attorney games, you don't even need to know who he is. All you need to know is that in the Adam in the anime adaptation, uh, they have the Japanese voice actor try to speak English, and it is it is very funny sounding. And so some of the English phrases that he says have gotten so stuck in my head that whenever I hear them in a normal context, my brain just immediately thinks of the Ace Attorney anime. Let's check out Umiyoshi Beef Bowls. It's too crowded. Sorry we're full right now, you could do takeout, but that service is only available to our members, but you could register to become a member online by using the code in our fan book. Please sign up if you like to, you could buy the fan book at the Net Cafe. So let's go do that. Uh, Umiyushi fan book. Thankfully, it's only 450 yen, so we don't have to worry about that being a problem. Uh, one thing that I should have brought up is vending machines. These are going to be some of your biggest friends when it comes to uh, SP items because you could, you could get a couple of them, and all they, although they don't do much, they are pretty cheap. So for this point in the game, uh, you'll want to check these often. You could get around two at a time. I believe these get restocked every week, so. Once a week, you might want to go check those out and grab some SP items. Uh, there are two, uh, there are three, uh, three vending machines that we can access at the moment. There are two at the strip mall, one at the dorm. Uh, let me see if I can go to that one restaurant that we couldn't get into, and if we can't, I'll just uh, become a member of Umiyushi. Oh, we actually can eat here. Uh, eating here will help with your academics. And I believe it does give you a good amount of uh, stuff. Seems like regulars, like a special offer on Monday, Thursday, Friday, and Sunday. My charm was at least confident. So you're starting to see there's a lot of stuff where it's like, man, if only I had higher social stats. So you'll want to raise all of them evenly. It's smarter that now that I've had some brain food. Just so you can get access to everything at around the same time. Still no level up on academics, huh? First day of May! Morning. Morning. It's been pretty warm lately, hasn't it? Well, it is already May. It's crazy how fast time flies. Yeah, definitely. Crazy how yeah. time flies. Seriously, and a lot's happened, and I'm sure that there's a lot more to come, too. Apathy Syndrome might not go away anytime soon, either. Since we're the only ones who can fight shadows, maybe we should be working harder. Besides, I need to get stronger, too. I can't have someone else protecting me all the time. Hey, did you hear? Sonata-san's getting checked up at the hospital today. He called me earlier and asked me to bring him something. Yep. He knows who to count on. He only asked you because you don't have anything better to do after school. Hey, I resent that. <laughs> Just kidding. So, what do you want you to bring? The class roster for 2E. Class roster? What's he want that for? Well, I don't have practice today, so I guess I'll come along and find out. You're coming too, right? Sure. Cool. Wait a minute. What? Is there a problem? Well, it was me, he asked. Um, is Sonata-san... Huh? ...in this room, by any chance? What are all of you doing here? We came to see you, but you look like you're doing just fine. That's because I'm just here for a checkup. We done here, Aki? Yeah, uh, thanks. I don't have time for this shit. You're... Never mind. Was that? A friend from school. Sort of. 
You know how the number of apathy syndrome cases has been increasing? Well, he knows a few people who are suffering from it. So, I thought we'd have a little chat. Hey, Junpei, did you bring what I asked? Of course I did. Thanks. All right, let's get going. But should you be moving your arm around so much? I'm fine. I've wasted enough time already. I need to get back to my training. By the way, Senpai, why boxing? You mean, why did I choose the sport? Well, it's not the sport itself I like. I just wanted to learn how to fight with my bare hands. I know what it's like to feel powerless. I don't ever want to feel that way again. Besides, I'm curious to see how strong I can get. It's like a game. Only I'm competing against myself. That's one way of looking at it. But hey, I got you. I'm into games too. <laughs> yeah, video games. Oh, but like fighting games. Whatever. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Oh, regarding Akihiko's recovery, it seems he'll still need some more time. Well, there's no need to rush things, you've all been working hard. Use the long weekend to rest. That said, there's been an uptick in the number of incidents lately, so don't be careless. I can't seem to shake this bad feeling I have. Perhaps it's just unnecessary concern on my part. Hey. Sonata-san's gotta be like a superhuman or something. Didn't a shadow injure him? But he's acting totally normal like it was no big deal. Normally people wouldn't be all like, I gotta heal up fast so I can jump back into the fight. He really is a boxing champ. Worlds apart from us ordinary folks, huh? Akihiko's still having some tests done. He should be back tomorrow, though. Who is that guy in Sonata Senpai's hospital room? You think he w it was a friend of his? Yeah, it seemed like it. Yeah. I guess he did say he was a friend from school. But I don't think I've ever seen him at school before, so I don't know. Let's go ahead and get registered for the Umayushi Bowl. Because I actually do want to check that out. And then eventually we'll try out Typing Ghoul and hopefully up our uh, courage. Members only, exclusive takeout perks. Looks like if I register, I'll be able to order takeout. Thank you for registering. We hope you'll enjoy the Umiyushi taste in the comfort of your own home. Looks like I've successfully become a registered member. Sweet, so now we can do that next time we... Uh, we'll try it out tomorrow and see if that gives us anything. I can hear people talking. Golden Week starts tomorrow. Do you have any plans? Eh, not really. But I'm not gonna miss tomorrow's show. Oh, totally. oh yeah, you're talking about Tanaka's Amazing Commodities, right? When I hear that jingle, I can't resist buying something. I never miss it when it's on, on Sunday afternoons. I'm about to go broke. A shopping program that airs on Sunday afternoons. Since tomorrow's Sunday, maybe I'll turn on the TV in my room to watch it. The first bell has rung. Sweet, so we still we have some more Chihiro stuff to do, and then... Uh, we can maybe hang out with Yuko, because there's something special about, um, there's something slightly different about the, uh, uh women's social links rather than the men's. Oh. But, uh, hello! Hello. <laughs> I was able to say hello to you! Although, the more I think about it, the more nervous I get. Mm. I hope I could get better at this somehow. Let's hang out. What? Huh? Uh, um, uh, this is so sudden. Um, I need to think about it. So yeah, we'll have her think on that, and then hopefully next time she'll be able to hang out with us. Anyways, you're the Strength Arcana. And we don't have one of those. I'm Valkyrie. The battlefield beckons. Let us march forward, together. Alright. So, what percentage is our compendium at? We're at 5% on the compendium, so... Not too bad. Hello. You done for the day? Want to go home together? Oh, oh Yuki-kun. I'm actually I've actually got to head out now to do some shopping for the track team, like buying athletic tape and stuff. There's a lot, so it'd be nice if I had an extra hand or two to carry everything. Hint hint. Oh uh, yeah. Thanks. Oh cool, thanks. I can't rely on the other team members at all. You get it, right Yuki-kun? Okay then, off to Pol Polonia Mall we go. Okay, shopping for club stuff is done. Good thing you came with me. I didn't realize there was so much to buy. 
Also, I wasn't really in the mental state to do this alone today. The best option to pick here is what happened. Oh, nothing major. Maybe I was exaggerating a bit. Hmm. It's still bothering me, though. On today's classic literature pop quiz, I didn't know any of the answers. And before I knew it, I dozed off. I ended up handing in a blank paper. Best option here is, it wasn't your fault. You know, right? I didn't do it on purpose. But then Mr. Okoda got all pissed off. He called me to the faculty office and told me I had to write a reflection essay. I had to listen to Mr. Okoda lecture me for the longest time. He was all like, uh, this rate you'll end up as a good-for-nothing adult, and you're not putting enough thought into your future. Come on, it's way too early to worry about the future, isn't it? We're still just teenagers. The best option here is, that's true. Right? We should be allowed to enjoy ourselves now, while we still can. Honestly, I haven't really thought about my future at all. I'm working hard for the track team, so I think that's good enough for now. As for the future, well, <laughs> I've got plenty of time to think about it later. Yuko is smiling happily. I feel like our relationship has grown. Hmm, I guess this isn't the best place for a long conversation, huh? I'm gonna go drop these off at the storage room. See ya! Ouch. Oh. Hey, it's dangerous to be running around here. Wait, aren't you? Oh, Andy Yuko. How many times do I have to tell you? You can call me Big Sis, nothing else. Oh no, they're gonna catch me. See ya, Andy. Hey, wait. And he's gone. That kid lives across the street from me. Why on earth are they playing tag in a place like this? I mean, it's dangerous, right? They should go play in the schoolyard or something. Oh no, the school gate is gonna close soon. Uh, I'll see you at practice! After saying goodbye to Yuko, I decided to go back to the dorm. Sup, dude? Finally, the three-day weekend starts tomorrow. I asked some peeps if they wanted to hang out, but the only ones interested were guys. You'd best use your time wisely. Need I remind you that midterms are quickly approaching? Uh, and here I was thinking I could live in blissful ignorance for a few days. Uh. So, um, interesting thing about uh, women's social links is that uh, once you get to a high enough rank with them, you have the option to romance them. And it, it doesn't really have any sort of effect on normal gameplay. It's just your final rank up with them, rank 10, is different. And during some holidays like Christmas, there there's some uh, you can hang out with them. Uh, it's something that's like some people in the fandom treat this at, treat romancing and stuff like that as if it's a big part of the game. I would say that less than one percent of the game is dedicated to dating and stuff like that. It's generally not that big of a deal. I will try to see if I can uh, start a relationship as soon as possible, just so we can see as many. Uh, dialogue changes as possible. But anyways, that's gonna be it for today's episode. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and in the next episode, we're gonna go ahead and continue. We're about three-fourths of the way to the full- the next full moon, which is very interesting, because as you probably guessed, since it's something that the game is keeping track of, it's something that's important. So, in the next episode, we're gonna see if we can get closer to the full moon, and hopefully find some more stuff out. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!